Hey folks, it's Daryl from Kamala Tech here. Um, excited to bring to you our newest feature for Kamala Document Control for Confluence Cloud, which is our Workflow Builder. The Workflow Builder allows you to customize and configure your workflow based on your business requirements. Um, in order to open up the Workflow Builder, all you need to do is come to the space settings of your space that you're working with. And um, as a system administrator, you can go in, or a space administrator, you can go in and start configuring or customizing your, your workflow based on your requirements. Easily done by simply clicking on the um, drop down arrow key beside the workflow that you want to modify. In the arc, my case, I'm going to simply take the quality management system workflow and edit this workflow by clicking the drop down arrow key and clicking on the workflow builder, edit workflow builder. You'll open up to our um, two panels, uh, our, our navigation uh, panel, our navigator panel, and the actual workflow panel on the left-hand side. A few things that are really unique to the workflow builder is the ability to um, add states, add um, uh, modify the workflow name, add a parameter, um, going in and modifying a state as well. If I don't want to add a new state, I can modify the state. So I can simply go in and modify the state name if I wanted to. Um, I could go in and um, click on apply and that's modified. I can add a new approval if I wanted to. So I can modify the approval if um, I wanted to add particularly um, a minimum feature to this to this workflow. I can go in and say that I need a minimum of two people to approve this in the and um, it can be based on as many people as you need it to be applied. Um, I can I can uh, <clears throat> set a all reviewers to be automated in this in the uh, workflow as well. So if I want to add my approvers right in my workflow, I can add that in my workflow builder or I can add groups as well. I can modify the uh, labels of my approval. So right now it says in approval uh, and make obsolete. I can change those if I wanted to, the, the actual um, action buttons that I that I use on there. Um, and I can um, modify um, the, um, the workflow itself in terms of removing states. So I can go in, take a state that's currently there, and I can also delete it right out. So I can go in and uh, delete that workflow completely out of um, <clears throat> out of the uh, tra transitions and states, and I can add a new one if I wanted to, as I mentioned earlier. Really cool, really exciting to uh, bring these features and functionalities to um, Kamala Document Control for Confluence Cloud. Um, feel free to test this out um, right from the um, marketplace, Lassian Marketplace. Download it, try it out. Um, if you have any questions, feel free to contact our support, support at kamalatech.com, or um, read up on our wiki at wiki.kamalatech.com for more on Confluence, uh, Kamala Document Control for Confluence Cloud. Thanks for joining me, and uh, have yourself a great day. Take care.